Jansen Chevrolet. The Bow Shed. And Bow Addicts present Midwest Farm and Land Companies on the Hunt. Hey guys, welcome to another edition of Midwest Farm and Land on the Hunt. I'm Brandon Schwartzlander. On today's episode, guys, we are hunting uh, turkey on the Hanging Rock Farm in uh, Clay County, Illinois. My buddies Ryan and uh, Doug from Georgia are up and I gotta tell you, these guys are awesome. I mean, they, they really, I don't know turkey hunting. Let me just be clear on that first, okay? I've done it a couple of years in a row. Killed a Jake, uh, not killed birds more than I've killed birds, but I'm, I'm learning, I love it. I see why people are enthused about it and excited about it. Um, so at any rate, Doug and Ryan came up and, and uh, Chad was on the camera. So we felt really good. We had turkeys gobbling early uh, before daylight. So we felt good about where we were gonna set up. I guess we felt good and then we moved. So we felt good and then Doug decided that we were gonna move. So we moved up the hill, probably took its toll on Chad a little bit more than it needed to, but that's another story entirely, we'll get to that. But at any rate, uh, so, so we got set up and, and had some, some really good things happening. As my luck would have it, it went south. And then at one point, Doug says, I know where these turkeys are and I'll bet you, or I don't know if he said I'll bet or I guarantee, or I promise, but whatever he said, I believed him. So the stock was on then. So imagine me not knowing what I'm doing. Now I've got a turkey decoy and a gun and I'm crawling through the grass trying to get up there. And as luck would have it, he was right. And uh, it's a, some really awesome footage. I'm not gonna tell you how it turns out, but I just want you to watch and enjoy. And again, we're doing this stuff for, for the benefit of of the average guy and I think that's what's cool about this. It's not about, you know, having the greatest footage or the perfect shot or this is just guys going out trying to have fun and, and, and doing things. Being with those guys, Chad and, and, and Doug and, and Ryan, is, it's just cool. I mean, it, when you can share the experience with your kids or your family or your buddies, you just can't beat it. So anyway, I hope you enjoy it. Right there. I thought it was, I thought it was. 
They, they, they got out here and I couldn't see. Dang it. It's alright. It's fine. Yeah. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. It's It's a big jig, you know? It looks good. Nubbins. Turkey season, boys. Just can't got kill started. A, can't kill a Tom, <laughs> kill a Jake. <laughs> it's all good. Listen, that was fun. Yeah. That was, uh, some swore heat. No, there was a shot. There was a, at least one, maybe two Toms right here. And, and then that, and that one's that back one's there. Reclaimed the field, but he's not leaving it. size bird for us. That's a super jake. Super jake. That's a super jake. <laughs> yeah, I mean, look at the head. Aren't their heads supposed to be something? That's a super jake, you know? I mean, the spurs tell the tail, but that's a super jake. His nuts have dropped. Man, I'll tell you what. A little carnage there, boys. Yeah, you got him to be pretty good. That's close enough to him, huh? Yeah, I, mean, I thought they were going to walk up on you. They were trying to, and then my fan folded. And I was like, oh. <laughs> Man, I thought for sure. That's a wicked pattern, you know? Yeah. Look at that. I mean, that's. Yeah. Laid him open. Mm, yeah. That's what you call a head rake or something. All right, let's measure his snood. Right, look, look what you did to his beat. Man, that pattern's good. Social distancing got its best right there, That's boys. Right. Got to bring in Georgia guns to help out. That's Doug right. on the call. Write custom calls. If you need a call, he can hook you up. Just let me know. I don't care if it's a Jake. That's bird number two and it's dead. They all eat the same. Remember when I said the other day that it's not really about trophies and all that good stuff and sponsors. It's just about having fun and this is fun because I get to share it with you guys and I'm just in no better way. So I'm uh, I'm all in for some turkey. That was fun, man. That's twice now I've stalked and shot a. Right? Same thing. Same thing down there. I just, I couldn't see around. Well, as soon as the big gobblers left, the do the bullies, right? these were gonna come on up here. They, they wasn't gonna do it with them. You notice as soon as they left and went right there, yep. immediately they started, these moved up right here on us. I thought for sure that was a, I saw, like I said, I thought I saw a long beard there coming up. Yeah, there was, but I, I for sure saw one had, I mean, he was, yeah, I mean, that's, uh, yeah, then right they there. dropped, when they dropped below the hill there, I couldn't see, so when they, I saw the head come up, mm -hmm. I mean, I figured at that distance, but, oh well. It's one in the truck. Did you get filmed on that? I, uh, I jumped, I think. Did you? <laughs> I wasn't expecting it. The whole time I kept saying, don't jump, don't jump. Don't jump. If he shoots, don't jump. <laughs> no, I made him pull up and, and I killed a Jake. <laughs> That's awesome. Hey, it gives Those are the gifts to keep on giving, brother. I appreciate yes, it. Listen, you Jake killer. <laughs> All that work. No, you didn't. Oh, yeah. Jake. Yeah, it is. Absolutely. Hey, hey, look. Listen. He shot the Jake in a group of long beards. I, no way. So I had to crawl with the fan from there, the tree, all the way around here. I got up to the corner where it, and they dropped down the hill right there. Well, let me get a picture here on you. My face on the back here with the thing in my man's truck. I'm going to sleep. I'm going to sleep. I'm going to sleep. I'm going to sleep. Right custom satchel. <laughs> You gotta make satchels. You can do good, actually. <laughs> I'm gonna put my man purse front and center right here. Yeah, you make sure it's in there good. I have since uh, this happened changed some of the things on Hanging Rock. I brought in a skid steer, did some more habitat work in hopes that, that next season will be even better yet. So I'm, I, I continue to evolve, evolve and learn. And I think that's what the coolest part about this is. Um, check us out on the website if you guys are looking, if you're thinking about buying a farm, selling a farm, the market's on fire right now. So please give us a call. Check out MidwestFarmCo.com. We'll talk to you soon, guys. Thanks.